and welcome back to another video. Um, yeah, you, you can see, I mean, I guess the, the middle things kind of, you can't see, but I, there's the word moron written on my forehead because I'm a moron. And I didn't just write this for the video. I literally had my friend, I walked up to my friend and I'm like, hey, would you do me a favor? Take this marker and write the word moron on my forehead. So I told him to do that, and then he did, and now this is what I've looked like for the last couple hours. Because I'm a moron, and I want everyone to know it. Also, I did something dumb, so I had to make myself do something else dumb on top of that, I guess. Oh well. Anyways. Now to the video, because that's what we're here for. Um, I went 8 and 6 last week. Which is not bad, but it's not that great, but it's not bad. Um, yeah, I'm 117, 75, and 1 on the season. The 1 obviously being the Lions tie, because then like, I'm not going to pick a tie. That'd be weird. That'd be dumb. So yeah, on to this week. Week 14, which has gone by really, really, really fast. Steelers-Vikings. Vikings is my pick. Even though Thielen's not playing, I think they're better than Pittsburgh. Even though Pittsburgh beat Baltimore, which I think is hilarious. Uh, especially the way it happened. If Lamar could throw, maybe the Ravens would have won. But he can't, so ha. Yeah. Uh, Falcons-Panthers. I picked the Panthers. This is a toss-up. I don't know who I really think will win, but I picked the Panthers because they're at home. Yeah. Because they're at home, I guess. Ravens-Browns. This may be a surprise to people who have watched this before. I picked the Ravens. Uh, I don't usually do that. I usually pick against them because I don't think they're that great. But the Browns also aren't that great. So I'm, I'm going to pick the Ravens, even though I hate them. Seahawks and Texans. Seahawks because the Texans suck. The Colts just, just shut them out last week. Go Colts. We're going to win more. Um, yeah. So yeah, 31 nothing. The Texans just suck. Um, but it'd be funny if the Seahawks lost this, but they won't. That's why I didn't pick them to lose it. So I picked the Seahawks there. Raiders, Chiefs, I went with the Chiefs because they're better than the Raiders. That kind of goes without saying, I think. Um, so yeah, that's my pick for that. Saints, Jets. Uh, I won't have the the BYU bias on this one, like I, I probably normally do when picking the Jets or games when Taysom Hill starts, because I'm a BYU fan, so I want them to do well. I think they're going to do well, and I picked the Jets last week. They didn't win, but they looked not bad for half the game. Um, Yeah, but both of the starting quarterbacks in this game went to BYU, so this will be fun. I can't wait to watch this. I'm going to pick the Saints because the rest of the team is better. Um... But I hope I hope both quarterbacks light up the scoreboard. I think that'd be awesome. Uh, Jags Titans. I pick the Titans reluctantly, even though I'm a Colts fan and I hate the Titans. The Titans suck. Yeah, Titans suck. Not like they're a bad team. Like I hate them. Suck. Stupid them. Um. So I'm a Colts fan this week, but they're on a bye. Well, I'm a Colts fan all weeks, but um. Well, <laughs> for the last month at least, I have been. Um, but they're on a bye this week, so I'm a Jags fan this week. Go, go Jags. But I picked them to lose. Cowboys football team. I saw something earlier that Mike McCarthy's, like, confident we're gonna beat the football team. And that's a red flag for me. Overconfidence is bad in sports. Gonna go with Washington. Lions, Broncos, um, Broncos, because... Even though the Lions finally won against the Vikings, which is hilarious. My friend who's a Packers fan thought that was funny because he hates the Vikings and doesn't hate the Lions because he knows they're never a threat. That's what he said, <laughs> which is funny. Um, that's why I don't have a problem rooting for the Texans as a Golds fan. They're not a threat. Um, anyway, so good for them. They got a win. Now they're 1-10-1. and You know, good for them. Sucks that they're going to have the number one pick in a year. There isn't a good quarterback, but oh well. Um, and I'm going to pick Denver to win because they're better and kind of hung with the Chiefs for, for most of the game. 
Uh, Giants, Chargers, stupid Chargers ended up beating the Bengals, which sucks. Even though I am a Colts fan, Bengals losing. Well, actually, that one didn't matter because they both were like the same record or something. So, yeah. Normally, it'd be good if they lost, but I I, I like Joe Burrow. I, I want them to succeed. I feel like the Colts could make it even if the Bengals keep winning. But this isn't even the Bengals game. The Chargers, I meant they were up like 22 or 24 nothing, and then Bengals came back and then won. No, if they didn't win. Then the Chargers pulled away and won. So a fumble. Uh, and I'm going to pick the Chargers to win this one. Niners, Bengals is the next one. I'm going to pick the Bengals. Um, Yeah, they're, they're at home. I think they're better than San Francisco. Even though Joe Burrow does have a finger injury, so that's a problem. I should look at my fantasy team. I have Joe Burrow. I tried to pick up Russell Wilson this week. I should look to see if I got him, huh? In which case, I would not root for the Texans to beat the Seahawks. I'd hope for them to keep it close so the Seahawks keep passing. Anyways, that's not what we're talking about. I get so off track in these. See? Moron. Because that's what I am. Um, But Niners Bengals... I'm going to pick the Bengals, because I think they're better. So, yeah. Bills, Bucks. This one was the hardest one. I went back and forth. I have just changed this, uh, like, 10, 15 minutes ago. So, this this used to be the Bills as my pick, but I picked the Bucks in the end. Because they're at home, I guess, and they're better, and the Bills just lost to the Patriots, who threw three passes. It's a little weird. Um, But, yeah, I'm going to pick the Bucks. This will be a fun game. There are a lot of fun games this week. Bears-Packers is not one of them, though. Uh, the, the Packers will annihilate them moving on. It's a boring Sunday night game. Uh, Monday night. Rams-Cardinals, which will be fun because they're, they're both really good. They're both division opponents. So I just think that'll be it'll be fun. I, I can't wait. Um, I, I picked the Cardinals because they're at home. Uh, by the way, I picked three road teams to win this week, so I, I don't know if that'll happen. I hope it does, because that'd be good for me, because I picked the picks right, but yeah. Um, not, like, that wasn't intentional. I didn't just say, okay, home team, home team, home team, and no. Like, that just happened. I guess all the better teams are at home this week, except for the Seahawks, and... Saints and apparently Ravens I picked so yeah, but anyway the Cardinals are Are good Rams are also good can't wait. I picked the Cardinals. So yeah Those are my picks. Um, yeah, th those are the picks. Uh now I, I Don't have anything else to say so I'm going to go watch a volleyball game that I recorded earlier between BYU and Purdue um, that'll be fun. I don't know who I'm rooting for. Uh, I love both those schools. So, yeah, that'll be hard. But it'll be fun, hopefully. Hopefully one wins. I would imagine one does. So, yeah. I, 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 that was like when I picked the Tigers to win the Clemson LSU National Championship. That's what that was like. Just, I hope a team wins. Yeah, because uh, I'm a moron. You see? You see why this is written on my forehead now? Because I, I am one. So yeah, those are my picks. See you guys next week, and bye.